Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario. In the last episode, we progressed a little bit more through Shy Guy's toy box. We got to the pink station and we flipped that lever all the way over there. We also met Gourmet Guy who was a an extremely overweight uh, Shy Guy who needed the most finest of food. So now we get to go on to the green station because we finally got to go. Or we finally got the uh, track fixed. Now I'm going to shut up and actually show you this Sticking animation. Next stop, Green Station. Now arriving at Green Station. Passengers wishing to go to Slot Machine, please exit. That's another reason why I didn't really talk, because I realized how loud it was in editing, so... <laughs> station stop, Green Station. Welcome to Green Station, passengers. Alright, great. Hello, sir. This is Green Station. I'm certainly feeling green. Shy guys hit our tracks. How are we supposed to move? Oh, by the way, a shy guy with a book ran off to the right towards the slot machine. I'm sure the little rogue stole that bulk book from someone. It'll be impossible to catch him unless you figure out how to get through the wire fence. Cool. Um... There's a bunch of things. What? Nope, that's not it. Just a bunch of shy guys. Okay, you guys aren't worth the EXP. <laughs> so apparently, if you don't get that right, then, um, it, uh, yeah, you, 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 get, you get penalized. For a second, I thought I had done it right, because I know you have to do it with, like, a code. But for a split second, I legitimately thought that, like, I was going to, uh, but I almost got it correct. Uh, fight against the current! Fight against the current! Oh, wait, there's a thing right here. Ah! I didn't even see that. Okay, so we need to get through the grate. So, thankfully for us, our dear party member Bo lets us face through things. There's a shy guy with a paper. You're a very naughty man, sir. Oh man, we don't even have... <laughs> ah, dang, I thought we had, um... Just thinking... Oh my god, I have so many thunderbolts, Jesus. Um, I thought we had... stinking enough star power, but I guess not. So, Bombette, do your thing, girl. I haven't used Bombette in quite a while. Um, we literally have nothing that we can attack with multiple people with. Okay, that's unfortunate. Whatever, we'll just stomp their faces. But with our power plus badge, we're taking, like, almost no damage. At least when I get the stupid command right. Alright. Sit on their heads. And then we'll body slam with Bombat. Bonk. I can't wait for the next level up so we can get, you know, more FP and then we'll be able to, like, remove one of the FP plus badges to get some more, um, things. Uh, you can't read this. Show it to someone who is very smart. Curious. Okay. Uh, there is a slot machine here. There is a war guy. Spy guy? One, two, three. Two shy guys, we didn't even get the coin. That's stupid. Alright, well, let's continue onward. There must be something of interest here. Oh no! Do we have to wait for the stupid thing to be desynced? Okay, you know what? Here, what we might need to do is use paracarry. Ah! Oh well, what's this behind here? Ooh, a star piece. Nice. Didn't even try to go here. Okay. Let's try to figure this stupid thing out. This is. Such an effort, but I need to know what's in that box. Bro! Ah, there we go. Here, carry, carry me over, carry me over, carry me over. Ah! Ah! Come on. Just a bunch of coins, really? Oh, how does that not? Whoops. Okay. Carry me over, Harry. Absolutely nothing. Okay, great. Thanks. Um... Oh, come on! What do you mean I can't jump that high? 
Okay, do I have to really wait for this stupid thing to be in sync so I can jump on it again? Bruh. There we go. Jesus. Carry me back over. Is there another star piece behind here? No? A super soda. Cure shrinking or poisoning and restores 5 FP, which is quite nice. What's in this key? A dictionary. The scholar Rust T's dictionary. Return it to him. Okay. Backtracking to Toe Town again. Alright. Great. Let's go. You know, I never realized how much backtracking there was until I had to do this again. Uh, but while we're here, um, we have Jump Charge, Spin Smash. Uh, Mario hits an enemy, smashes into the one behind it. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll, I'll buy this badge. Why not? Yeah, yeah, one, got it. We don't have much BP left, but you know what? We'll just keep buying the badges, because we can. But while we're out in Toad Town, I forgot to return that mailbag to the post office. So, hello, sir. Shy guys full of bull. Yeah. Shy guys stole a full bag of mail from us. We failed in our duty. Come rain or sleet or snow or shy guys, we're supposed to deliver no matter what. Whatever can we do? Well, here's your mailbag. Oh, that's it. That's it. The bag. Thank you, Mario. You'll never know how many people will be happy to get mail. Let me give you a small thank you gift. Got a star piece. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> Alright, now we have to go find Rusty to, uh... Uh, stinking giving back his thing, which I'm not mistaken, I believe he's like over here in this house back here. This one tiny little house. You're rusty, right? Curses! Mario! A shy guy stole my dictionary! Please get it back from him! I'm- I'm losing IQ points! Uh, well here's your dictionary. My dictionary! How wonderful words! Many thanks, Mario! Got a star piece. And then a mysterious no. You're smart, you can read it, right? That's what you need the dictionary for, right? You'd like me to translate this note for you? Well, let's see. Aha! It seems to be written in the language of the Shy Guys. Let's see here, yes. Accents, mmm, silent D, hmm. Yes, it says hit yellow, green, red, then blue. Yellow, green, red, then blue. Yellow, green, red, blue. Okay, I'm gonna forget. Is that written? No, no. One, one more. Wait, what does the stream sign say? There's a sh oh, okay, cool. Um, I'm, I'm, I've already forgotten. Yellow, green, red, blue. Yellow, green, red, blue. Okay, hold on. I need to try to memorize this. Okay, my keys. My keys for stored for um. I don't remember what they're for. The keys for my lock are yellow. The light on my capture card is green. Um, my room is red. And then... We Remote Light is blue. Okay. Keys, capture card, room, We Remote Light. Got it. <laughs> that is, that is actually a very, that is actually a, um, a, a, a thing to help remember things. I forget what it's called. I think it's like loci or something. Memory of loci or something. Where basically, in order to help you remember things, what you want to do is that you want to try and visualize it in your physical space. So like if you're in a room, try to memorize it by imagining things in that given area. So, you know. It's a good little memory trick. Anyway, back to Green Station. Alright, green station. Okay. So, yellow keys, green capture card, red room, blue light. And that brought down the thing! Perfect. See, that memory trick does work. Didn't write it down at all. Let's continue. Where would you like to go to Rod Station? All right, last stop, all aboard. Uh, don't care. All right, this is our last stop. 
We're almost through Shy Guy's toy box. Alright, there is a heal block here. Doesn't restore our star points. Are there two ways to go here? Like always, there is. Um... You know, I think... Uh, I think this way is... Where we want to go. Oh! Pyro guy! Oh! Alright. Uh... We want to jump up on here. Over here. And then there's a little ferris wheel, but there is a block that we can hit up there. I need to hit it. It's my my sense of Ah, just a coin block. Just a stupid coin block. Alright. It's another elevator. There is a power-up block over there. Oh boy. Uh the the I see, that's where we can go. I saw there's a power block, but I think we'll leave that alone for right now. Someone has come. Someone is here in the dark. Oh, could it be? It's Mario. Looks like you're mine, Mario. <laughs> I won't let you go anywhere. And we have another mini boss fight. Anti guy wasn't the only thing. We, <laughs> I'll take good care of you quickly. Then return to my darkness. I misspoke. I hate the light. So I'll take you with me to the deep dark. Goodness. All right. Now, if I remember with this guy, you need to hit the lantern. Oh crap. Uh, Bo might actually be very useful for this, because she technically hits it multiple times. Yeah! Bo, you go, girl! Oh, that light! It's so bright! It's no good! Here, darker and darker. And then he blows it out. Dude, you really undoing all the work that we just did? Alright, Bo. Oh, crap! Uh, big Lantern goes. Oh, Morley! Heck yeah! You go, girl. Uh, one, two. Wow, that was good. Oh, crap! Oh, crap, Bo! I'm so sorry! Can I at least switch my... No, I can't even switch my member. Oh! Um... I hope I don't kill him by accident, because I want to be able to tattle him with Gumbario. Uh, yeah, we can't hit him when, uh, the thing's blown out like that, so we need to hit the lantern. Crap! Ow, ow, ooh, ouch. He, he a big boy. Um, hit the lantern. Two, so hopefully that's enough to see him. I want to be able to, I want to paddle him with Goombario. Uh, there we go. This is a big lantern ghost. He avoids attacks by hiding in the dark. Max HP 40, attack power 5, attack or defense power 0. Your friends, like <clears throat> me, will also be damaged when he does the flash attack. The flash attack's power is 2. Hit the lantern many times to make it brighter, then you'll be able to attack him. As soon as you can see, hit him right in the head. Got him. So actually, Bo is probably going to be one of the most useful party members in this fight because you can hit the lantern multiple times, and that will illuminate the room without us having to necessarily waste a turn. So, good job, Bo. Ow, oh, crap! Well, thankfully we only need to hit it like four times. I'm not doing very well with the stupid things. Uh, oh, Thunder Rage is different from Thunder Bolt. Oh, strikes all enemies, strikes one enemy. Use it on the big lantern ghost. Sure, because we have plenty of Thunder Rages. Thunderbolts. Crap! Bo, I'm so sorry! <laughs> Bo, I'm so sorry! You know, I'm just gonna use up all these stinking Thunderbolts, because we have so many of them. I just don't use them. Besides, at this point, you know, using my hammer is probably just as strong. You stupid jerk, you blowing it out again. 
Alright, uh... Sure, we'll jump on it. Ooh, crap. Ugh. I'm getting awfully close. Can I hit him yet? Yes, I can. Uh... You know what? I can probably just... Kill him. Wait, no. Probably not. Unless I use Bombette. Because she can... Only the lantern. Okay, thank you. Um, so maybe I can't. Maybe Paracarry can? How much does this stupid sky du shell, shell Scott thing do? We'll see. Paracarry, if you fail me. Nope. We got it. Cool. I was gonna be very upset with him if he didn't do the thing. No! Hello? Hi, mister. I'm what? Can I um, get out of here? Here you go. <laughs> Yay, I got out! Yay for me! Thanks, mister! Hey, aren't you, um, Mario? You just saved me like a hero! You're a hero, aren't ya? You? You're the coolest! You saved me from the mean guy who laughed like wee hee hee! I gotta make it up to you. I'll go with you, Mario, okay? I heard the, um, sad guy saying that you're trying to save Princess Peach from Bowser. You're super great! You're the greatest great guy! I think you're the best. So, um, I really wanted to help. I'll be good, really? And we got a new party member! Watt joins your party. Press down to have her illuminate the area around you. With her light, you can see invisible blocks, too. While in battle, she can shock enemies with Electro Dash or paralyze them with Power Shock. Oh, it's pretty dark, huh? I kinda like the dark. But, um, I can show you now how helpful I can be, okay? Use my power, okay? And with that... Wow, pretty cool, huh? Looks it's so bright now. Tee-hee-hee. <laughs> I bet nobody else can help out like that, huh? Can they? Nope. Now let's go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so like that, we can, uh... Light, light up the dark. And there are going to be hidden blocks, um, that are illuminated. So like here, you can't see it, but with Watt, there is extra hidden blocks. We got another snowman doll. And this is why I didn't want to, uh, quite do... Uh, that power up block quite yet because we just got a new member and like always Gumbario is not worth it um, So which party member do you want to upgrade? We're gonna just go straight for Watt um, We have immediately we immediately have a mistranslation error because During that little tutorial scene uh, Watt was described as a female and now it says Hill Tur Master Turbocharge um, I believe Watt is female uh, canonically, and this is just, you know, there's just a bunch of, like, mistranslation errors. And I think in, like, Super Paper Mario, when you get, um, her catch card, it also refers to Watt as male. But I'm pretty sure Watt is supposed to be a female. So, it's just a weird little, you know, translation error thing. But anyway, we have another hidden block with a, an, a volt room. And since we've been doing a lot of backtracking, ooh, we have another hidden block. Uh, I think we're just gonna power through for the rest of this, because I think there isn't much left of this area, so... Yeah, we're just gonna power through. Uh, so we wanna heal up first. Now we can keep going with Watt in our hands. Oh! Don't know what this is all about, but... Uh, looks like we need Bombette again for, you know, first time in quite a while. And I guess technically we used her in the, uh... Uh, the, the Tub of Blubba chapter to find that hidden room, but... <laughs> You're screaming so loudly! Oh, Poor guy. You gotta run in fear. Alright. Let's keep Watt out, because there's probably gonna be something that we can find. Yeah, like this. Hidden coin block. Oops, gotta let her go. And then we can jump on... I said, I said we can... We can... We can jump on it. And then we can use Cooper to hit that block. To get, I believe this is a shooting star. A shooting star 
Hits all enemies attack power 6, so it's even better than a Thunder Rage. Uh, I think just got a Voltrum, so we don't really need the Voltrum that much. Yeah, I haven't really been using items too much, have I? Please, sir. Please, sir. Leave me alone. Another Sleepy Sheep, which we don't need. Sir, please! Ow! Alright, uh, that was not a great battle, but we're back to why. Um, I didn't really get to use her in that battle, so, um... I might just use a mushroom really quick, even though I only have 5 HP to heal, so... Ugh. Yeah, I don't really have any FP recovering items, so... Ugh. Oh well, you know what? Let's just keep going. There's a giant dark room, so we have to illuminate it. Run, run for it! Why, help me! And they bust through the wall. Oh, isn't that cute? Come on. So you came, did you? I'm General Guy. We're following the orders of King Bowser by guarding a star spirit. As long as we keep it secure, we have permission to do whatever we want. You hear? I don't care for you, sir. You're rude, and furthermore, you're trespassing in here. Our toy box is off limits to the likes of you. The treasure inside this box are for shy guys only. And that Star Spirit's fate is none of your business. Actually, it's all of my business. Prepare to fight me, sir. Taste defeat. Charge! Weren't y'all just running, like, right before? Okay, guys. All together now. Let's rush them. Charge! Uh, you know what? Let's get Goombario out first. Tell me about these guys. Shy Squad. This is the Shy Squad. It'll attack us with all its members at once. Max HP 15, attack power 1, defense power 0. The number of times we're attacked will equal the number of Shy Guys in the squad. Its attack power is huge when there are many Shy Guys, but it drops for each one that falls. Let's use an attack that does tons of damage so we can decrease their numbers and increase our chances. Uh, so we probably want to use a very strong move, which, unfortunately, I don't really think there's anyone. I think jumping is straight up the best bet. One, two, so that defeats three. Oh wait, they can't even touch us! Because <laughs> they're doing, because it's one damage multiple, time, multiple times, it's like bow. Oh, that's funny. Um, but let's bring Watt out just to show off what she can do. Um, but this shouldn't be enough to... Kill them. But that's really funny because we have the damage plus batch, they can't even touch us because it's one damage multiple times and you know, one minus one, zero. But Watt can penetrate the defenses, so it's very good. Mercy, he beat them all up! That surely isn't good. Guess it's up to me! Oh, we have a, uh. Oh, poor shy guy, he got hit. He should be dead because that probably hit him really hard. Mario, you sir will pay. You beat my infantry, but that's all you'll do. Prepare for the next wave! Goodness. Shy guys on stilts. Wow. Go! Attack, stilt guys! Fight, fight, fight! Yes, sir! Right away, sir! Um, but yeah. Uh, Watt can, uh, infiltrate enemies' defense. Or penetrate it, so they can- she can- she'll deal, like, a set amount of damage every time. Tell me about stilt guys. This is a stilt guy! Yes, as the name suggests, stilt guys are shy guys on stilts. I mean, it seems pretty obvious to me. Max HP 7, attack power 4, defense power 0. If you attack them by shaking the ground, they'll fall off their stilts and become normal shy guys. Wow, like the game is really slowing down. This is quite a lot for a, uh, <laughs> an N64 game, but we can just do Star Storm, whatever. Take them both out. Who cares at this point? Just beat them all at once. Never even stood a chance. Oh, we don't even get EXP for that? Grr! Unbelievable! I guess it's time for my special battalion! Goodness, there's a lot of Shy Guys here. Ho 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 ho! I pity you, sir! It's time you paid, Mario! Attack! Yes, sir! 
Okay, good Mario. What the heck are these guys? Shy stack? This is a shy stack. Whoa, this pile has an incredible sense of balance. Look at that stack. Max HP 10, attack power 1, defense power 0. Its attack power equals the number of sh guys in the stack. It will be 4 if there are 4 guys stacked up. If you have the spin hammer ability, you can knock them off one by one. Obviously, their attack power decreases when there are fewer of them in the stack. I'm talking very slowly because the game is slowing down quite uh, immensely. Um, so I think the spin hammer, I think that's the one that I actually bought in the bad shop before. Ouch, that actually does some damage. Uh, but nonetheless... Nonetheless, we will switch to... Uh, you know what? Let's just do Bombat. Whatever. Come on, girl. There we go. Six damage. They die. I'm so sad, we don't even get any experience points for this. Ow! Crap! Unbelievable. Uh, you know what? Uh, I'm gonna focus to get my star's power energy back and then Bombette can finish them off. It's going to be a longer episode, ain't it? I honestly forgot that there were all these guys before General Guy. Ah! Uh, Gagu! Fine, I'll beat you myself! Nobody embarrasses the brave shy guys in my army? Nobody! Okay, sir. Uh, Goombario. This is the last time I'll need you. I'm so glad that I have this thinking quick change badge. This is General Guy in his tank. The tank seems to be dangerous even though it's a toy. Max HP 30, attack power 4, defense power 2. Not only does the General give commands from the tank, but he also throws bombs and uses electric attacks. The power of his electric attack is 5, and your party member takes 2 damage points, so defend yourself carefully. He'll lose the electric attack if we break the light bulb. Normal fighting styles seem ineffective because the tank is well fortified. So, this might be good to bring out Bo. Or not Bo. Watt. Excuse me. Um, can't use her though, because that. But we can break the bulb. So we can land on it. And like that, he throws bombs. Um, we just keep landing on the bulb. And that breaks the bulb. Awesome. Uh, and then Watt has Electro Dash, which penetrates defense power, power shock, and uh, turbo charge. Um, so that boosts our power. Now, Electro Dash should be dealing 4 damage because it can penetrate defense. Yep, see? Normally it would be dealing 2 because of the 2 defense points, but it can penetrate it. Grr! My high tech tank defenses don't seem to stand up to that electric attack! Quite, quit doing that! It's too powerful! You're breaking the rules of war! Yeah, sure. Um, I believe with Mario doing the hammer would be a little bit better. Because I think her jump attack will only be dealing one. But with the hammer we'll be dealing three, so it's two versus three, so a little bit better. Yeah, yeah, sir. You ain't you ain't nothing. One, two, three, go! I wonder if the Thunder Rages deal more damage because they're electric too. That'd be cool, I should try that. You're just gonna keep throwing bombs at me? You know what, sure, let's try a Thunder Rage. Does it deal five? Dang, I should've saved my Thunder Rages for this fight, jeez. <laughs> Thunder Rage, or Electro Dash, whatever the heck this move is. You ain't worth nothing. That's okay. We're going to... Do an Electro Dash. That should kill him. Haha! <laughs> Holy crap! That's like sick. Oh my god! 68 star point! Holy crap! That's so awesome! BP has reached maximum, can't increase it anymore. <laughs> Holy crap! That's really funny, actually, because I'm pretty sure that happened in Chugga Conroy's Let's Play of Paper Mario 2. 
And I haven't watched that in like years, but I remember that happening. That's so funny. That's so funny. But like 68, dude, that's like almost a whole level up. That was amazing. Um, I don't know. Do I want to do... You know what? I'm going to do FP so I can take off one of the badges. Yeah, run away in fear. Hmm, poor guy. Yay, you beat, we beat the Shy Guys! <laughs> you weren't so tough, you silly old Shy Guys. I beat him up, didn't I, Mario? Yes, you did, Watt. You did good. You did very, very good. Alright, let's save this last star spirit. End of chapter! To save the fourth star spirit, Muscular, Mario and his team disbanded the gang of Shy Guys Tufts. Slowly, it seems as if the life force is returning to the once bleak night sky. But the stars won't truly shine until the star rod is wrested from Bowser's evil grasp. Three star spirits still await rescue. Where in the world are they being held? Alright. Uh, so that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this content, leave a like. Maybe consider subscribing or leave a comment. Whatever feels good for you. And with that, I will see you guys in the next episode, where we continue on with our journey. See you guys then. Mm -hmm.